Weighing scale is a tool to measure your weight, but most of the people use it as a weapon. If you are one of them and if you have planned many times to start losing weight but you get failed easily, then this video is for you. Keep on watching. The first mistake you do more often that you are so obsessed with the weighing scale and the number pops up in between your feet. You become so obsessed about it and that's the biggest mistake you do more often. Instead, you can be obsessed for choosing a healthy lifestyle and schedule exercise routine. Most of the people take new year resolution and in which losing weight is one of them. If you are one of them who takes new year resolution to lose weight but you do party on 31st December and you eat lot of junk food and you just think that uh, anyhow you are going to adopt a healthy lifestyle from very next day so you are on the wrong path. Why do you wait for a specific day and time to adopt a healthy lifestyle? Do it right now. You became suddenly motivated and you want to lose weight because you have to attend party or weddings or you have any travel plans. You want to wear nice clothes so you want to lose weight. For that you adopt an unrealistic goal to lose weight. So what exactly you do? You want to lose 10 pounds. Wow, that idea is super. It is unrealistic. I would recommend you to uh, lose 1 to 2 pounds each week because that is the most reasonable and realistic way to lose weight. Uh, gradually when you see that you are losing weight, it will motivate you automatically to set your routine and to adopt a good uh, lifestyle. Here your aim should be realistic and you have to set short term goals so that you can achieve it then you can get motivation to continue this thing further. Another mistake that people do, they want to go for celebrity diet to lose weight fast. That diet also called FAD diet. Um, that diet is very famous to melt away your belly fat so quickly uh, but in long term it is not good. The diet explains you to stick to one food regularly so you have to stay away from another foods and if you follow that kind of diet uh, you will not get proper nutrition and so you should avoid that kind of diet because it's not sustainable in future. If you are uh, doing a lot of efforts to lose weight and you feel guilty many times because of your body shaming your body takes time to adopt any routine which you are following right now when you feel more guilty at the time you eat more junk foods that is a reality so I would suggest you to make a healthy relationship with food use your guilt as a motivator to keep losing weight further people have made that skipping meals can do wonders actually it's not if you skip your meal your metabolism rate gets slowed down which means your body burns less calories actually skipping meal doesn't help to lose weight at all. Here I'm going to tell you that skipping meal and intermittent fasting is completely different on which I'm going to talk about separately. Uh, your body needs proper nutrition every day to do your routine activity so don't follow this kind of routine. You choose high intensity exercises and you think that you will lose weight quickly. That's the biggest myth guys. If you are not regular for doing exercise that you have to start from low to moderate exercise. If you start any kind of intense exercise uh, and for that your body is not prepared you can get injury as uh, you can have health problems also as we all know that if we sweat we lose weight people do a lot of mistakes uh, they usually wear sweatpants and sweatshirts in hot weather and they stretch their time in sauna bath so that they can lose pounds if you spend too much time in sauna bath you are losing sweat but you are going towards dehydration also you are also losing electrolytes vitamins and minerals too and the last mistake which people do that they usually focus on food and exercise but what about your mental health you are eating healthy and you are doing exercise but you are not sleeping properly and you don't have a proper routine that can also create stress and your life could be disturbed because of that this could be the reason that you get failed to lose weight as well if I summarize my video, there is no shortcut to lose weight. You have to give time to your body and moreover, you have to lose weight safely and you have to improve your mental health also. If you think that this video has added value in your life, then take a moment and click on subscribe button. I will see you in my next video. Till then, bye-bye.